guys, so today is Monday and I went to the grocery store, to be honest with you, to buy some lunch meat and I came out with all of this. Um, this week we kind of slipped up on our groceries and we went out to eat three times, so we spent like $50 three times, which is not bad, but yeah, so I'd rather just not do that. So I decided I'll just get a few things that we need, actually everything we need and more. But um, I got this organic macaroni and cheese. I'm going to make um, baked chicken with collard greens and macaroni and cheese, and this was organic, so I've never tried it. Um, hopefully it's just, yeah, the cheese is organic. Okay, cool. So that's that. It was only $1.50, or they were, yeah, two for $3, so it was $1.50. Then I got this boil in a bag white rice. I'm going to make um, tonight for dinner, we're having our chipotle night, but it's gonna be homemade chipotle. So I'm gonna make the uh, cilantro lime rice and this is just so much easier, it tastes the same. Then I had to get my husband some sugar in the raw. Sorry, that was like, whoa. <laughs> um, now these, this is kind of an impulse, I don't buy these, but um, they were organic. I mean, I like to make my own, obviously, and I ran out of tea bags, but these were two for four dollars. They're the mint and honey green tea. Now, sometimes I'll buy the bottles, like if I'm at the gas station or if I'm at Publix just quickly, and they're like a dollar a bottle, so I thought that was a good deal. And um, here are our um, fiber ones. Um, they're kind of like they're granola bars, so these are our little snacks. My husband likes the brownie ones because he has like sensitive teeth, and these are they're actually pretty good. They taste like brownies, so that's you know <laughs> that's the point, I guess. But now these are good, and then I got uh, the chocolate caramel and pretzel. Oh my god, it tastes like a candy bar, and it's only 90 calories. Delicious. So I'm gonna go back this way. Um, I got, let's see, two, four, six. I got six yogurts. I got two blueberry, two uh, key lime pie, and two strawberry banana. We usually like Greek yogurt, but it, like I said, I think last week, it's so expensive. So uh, these were, I think, 20 yogurts for $8, which that's like so cheap. But, you know, it's not Greek, but it's a Publix brand too, so. We'll give them a shot. I've never tried them before. We'll see how we like them. Then I got some bananas. And my husband and I were talking about the tuna. Like, obviously it's nice to have fresh tuna, but sometimes when you're on a pinch, these are nice to put in a salad. And I do not like the ones in the can, even though it's the same brand, in water, etc. I feel like it tastes different when it's in these packets. And these are usually like um a dollar fifty each and they were a dollar so same price as the can so I just got three of those and I got some spring water um just to have I guess I need to go get this little thing filled today maybe at Walmart okay and then I got these smoothie packets now these are definitely not the most healthy things for you but um I kind of I don't use the whole packet I use like half a packet per smoothie so I got, a, I got two strawberry ones, that's the ones I like. Um, and then I got my husband the tropical mango and the banana one, he likes those. Then I got some clementines, these were kind of expensive, but you know, they're really good. So I think it was $6.99 for this bag, I don't know, to me that seems expensive. So I got those, um, we still have a little bit of orange juice, but um, Sometimes I like to switch it up. Some weeks I like to buy orange juice and some weeks I like to buy like either clementines or oranges. A uh, good way to get our vitamin C. Okay, then I got one lemon. I have a few in the fridge still. Got an avocado for tonight. I'm going to make guacamole. And I have the cilantro in the fridge still. Um, I buy the one in the tube. I, it lasts longer and I believe it's organic. And at the time you're like, oh okay, cilantro is only a dollar. Um, but you don't use the whole bushel, at least I don't, and it goes bad. So I just buy the tube and it's like three dollars. So, um, yeah, I just keep that in my fridge. I'm making guacamole. Got some organic romaine lettuce. This was like a deal, it's only three dollars. So, we love romaine, and I do not like to buy 
lettuce, I try not to buy anyways, uh, lettuce that, um, that isn't organic because I think it tastes disgusting. So I still wash these, obviously. I got three apples. I have two in the fridge still. And I got three little uh, Baby Bella peppers for um, tonight and then some peppers for our eggs in the morning. I like to make these with omelets. They're really good with olive oil, garlic, mushrooms, eggs, and a little bit of jalapeno. It's really good. Okay, and our lunch meat, I'm, I tried to buy, I wanted to buy turkey. That was my intention. And to be honest with you, I just don't like it. I know it's healthier. I just, I hate it. So this is what you get. I got um, capicola. It's like a, it's like a spicy ham. And then I got the boar's head pepperoni. I only get a half a pound and then a quarter of a pound. Then I get a quarter of a pound in the um, boar's head mozzarella. It's like really good. I put some um, oil and vinegar or mustard, whatever you want to put. But it's like this combination so good. Okay, um, I got two jalapenos. Like I said, for tonight I'm making guacamole. I like to put jalapenos in my guacamole. And I like to just have a jalapeno on hand. Sometimes we put it in our burgers or our eggs, like I said. So it's just nice to have those on hand. And lately these have been so hot. I mean, I don't know where they're coming from. I'm going to look and I'll, maybe I'll post it down below. But these are so, so hot lately. It's crazy. Good, but crazy. Okay, and then I got the um, tomato on a vine. And I was really disappointed with the tomatoes um, at my local Publix near me. Um, I saw a bunch of fruit flies. I was intentionally looking for Roma tomatoes and they looked disgusting. So I was so upset. So I had to settle for these. They were on sale. I mean, they're not, definitely not my favorite tomato. But yeah, so I, had to, I got four of those. It was like $2 or something. Okay, and then I got some strawberries. They just looked really fresh today. They haven't been lately, so I have. I actually have some in the fridge still. But um, I like to buy these if they're on sale and they look good, wash them, and then freeze them. So I got those over $2. Then I got our favorite, um, the steam bags of broccoli and cauliflower. This is so good just as a little side. I just... I steam them in the bag like it says. I put garlic powder and maybe a little bit of butter or olive oil and salt and pepper. It's really good. Okay, and then I got some flour tortillas for my husband. He's going to make um, burritos with his chipotle night. I'm going to have the bowl with just the rice and the vegetables and chicken. Okay, back over here. Dripping all over the place. I got some coffee. I got the Maxwell House Wake Up Brush. This was on sale for $7.99, I believe. And it says it makes up to 240 cups. We usually like to buy the Starbucks fresh coffee, but I also like this one once in a while, and it was a better price. So that's, um, that's what I got this week. Or this will probably last us yeah, two weeks. We are big coffee drinkers for sure. And then I got uh, the vanilla latte by Starbucks for myself and my husband, the Cafe Mocha ones. These are good for class. We are in college still, so sometimes we like to take those to school. Then we needed two, uh, we both needed toothbrushes, so this was a good deal. The Oral-B, I think each toothbrush by itself was like $3.89. I got both of these for $4.89, and it says it has like the scope mouthwash on the uh, bristles, so... Yeah, we'll see. I really like the Reach ones, but for some reason Publix doesn't carry Reach brand. So, I'm not sure where I bought this. Probably Walmart. But, um, yeah, so that's what I got there. Then I got Goldfish. These were buy one, get one free. I got the Parmesan for my husband and then the Queso Fiesta for me. This replaces our chips or um, our crunchy snacks, I guess, for the week. <laughs> I know we're like children we have to have little snacks but if we don't honestly it's like okay just you know buy candy bars like that's not happening so um then I got my husband some gel he just likes this LA looks uh wet look I think he likes the sport look but they this is all they had so it's only a dollar fifty I don't know then I needed some more mustard and then these um Scotty's tissues or buy one get one free they were $1.25, so yeah, two for $1.25.
Then I got some Blue Bonnet Butter. I ran out. I do, however, I like the Smart Balance, but I've been having mixed feelings on it, reading different things like it's good and then it's bad, it causes cancer, I'm not sure. So I'm just going to stick with the one I grew up on and Blue Bonnet until I figure out what I want to do. We don't, we do not, definitely do not use a lot of butter. We use um, olive oil and um, coconut oil, but once in a while I have to put this in a recipe, so I use it sparingly. And then I got some Chicago style deli bread. We like this kind. It's only $2.99. I, I used to like the bread that, you know, just comes like off the truck like Wonder Bread or whatever it is, but I, I don't know. I just feel like for the same price I would rather have one that's made fresh. So... Then I got the Greenwise Tenderloin Chickens. This was only C467, which was the same price as regular chicken. Now my husband and I always buy um, chicken in bulk and we freeze it, or you know at least we have lately. And I find sometimes I need chicken breasts and like chicken tenderloins and stuff like that for recipes. It's just easier. So I got one of these, and I have to go get chicken breasts. I forgot. Hello, Ashley. But yeah, so I got these for tonight. And then I got my husband some Yingling um, dark lager beer. He loves this. So it's his birthday on Wednesday. And he's been working so hard. We try to drink just wine, you know. But um, I, I don't like this beer. But this is his favorite. So it's on sale too. So that's always a great deal. So this is everything I spent, or everything I bought today, and I spent $90.84, and this will well over last us for the week, and maybe a little bit more. As you can see, as always, I still have a few little side items still, like these hot dogs, I never made those, and Jimmy has a little chicken, buffalo chicken pizza thing still, and I have chicken and all that. Oh yeah, and I bought this, um chopped spinach I'm making um what am I making Italian wedding soup and this is you need this for the recipe so that's everything I got this week I'm going to put all this away before it starts to get warm it's like 95 degrees in Florida and honestly when I came home some of this stuff was already warm so I'll talk to you guys later if you have any questions just leave them down below thanks for watching